In this word problem, we're going to combine the use of complementary and supplementary angles. Uh, to begin, we're going to get an idea about what we're talking with about here by uh, drawing a set of complementary angles, calling this A and C. Then we're going to try to duplicate A as best as we can into a, uh, a linear pair of supplementary relationship, A and S. Now we read our problem, and it says that the supplement of an angle is, so the measure of the supplement of an angle is 18 less than 3 times the complement. So 18 less, 3 times the complement of the angle. Now we have an equation in two unknowns and no other equation. So what we have to do is go back to what it means to be supplements and complements. A complementary angle sums to 90, so angle A plus angle C is equal to 90. And then we also know that supplementary angles sum to 180. So angle A plus angle S equals 180. Now, the idea that angle A shows up in both of these expressions allows us to hook those two equations together. What we have to do is uh, solve one of these equations for A. So we'll pick this one. Uh, then angle A is equal to 90 minus angle C. Then by substitution, uh, 90 minus angle C plus angle S is equal to 180 degrees. Uh, by rearranging this expression, we get angle S minus angle C equals 90 degrees. Now what we can do is uh, take uh, this and we will substitute uh, this expression into our, our new equation. So uh, we get 3 times the measure of angle C minus 18 uh, minus angle C equals 90 degrees. Then uh, twice angle C minus 18 is equal to 90 by combining like terms. And twice angle C is equal to 108 degrees. So angle C is 54 degrees. Then we can find the measure of the supplement. Well, we can find the measure of the angle by subtracting from 90. Uh, so we're going to get uh, 90 minus 54, which is uh, 36 degrees. Um, then the measure of the supplement is 180 minus 36. So we get uh, 144.